Well, the coronavirus pandemic is having a major impact on an unexpected industry, lumber. Prices are just soaring. In fact, those increases are adding on average $36,000 to the cost of building new homes, and they're driving up costs for home improvement projects, too. News for Jacks reporter Corley Peel has been looking into the spike. And Corley, how is this affecting builders? Right now, there is a lack of supply for homes that are available for sale, so many people are, people are turning towards building. But what goes into building those homes, like lumber, is getting pricier, forcing many people to put their projects on hold. Reasonably priced lumber is hard to come by. A piece of plywood isn't cheap. What was pre-COVID uh, 8 to $12 is now 30 to $45. A viewer shared this picture with News for Jax, showing a small batch of plywood that they say costs up to $400. Ron Harris is a realtor and a general contractor. What is causing this spike in lumber prices? As increase in demand uh, for houses, uh, primarily due to low interest rates, demand has risen at the same time COVID has shut plants down. Lumber prices are up 340% from a year ago, according to Random Links, a wood products industry tracking firm. And the increase in housing is not just lumber, it's across the board. It's electrical, it's copper, it's concrete, it's windows. Harry says it could be a while before lumber prices go down. I think people are going to have to wait until this settles down. And I would say it's probably beyond 12 months from now before there's any change, but I, I just don't have a crystal ball. Harris says he encourages people to be patient with their builders and their contractors as the high prices of lumber and the lack of supply is impacting everyone. Reporting live, Corley Peel, Channel 4, The Local Station.